it's very it's very busy. It feels like a hive of activity. So we're all sort of it's a very bespoke um, factory here. It's very hands on. So we tend to sort of all get in each other's way a little bit, but everyone really um, joins together and gets the job done. All of our truffles, we basically are all hand uh, tempered and enrobed and dipped and we decorate everything. It's just, there's so many tiny little things, all the hand decorations uh, on the enroba chocolates and the dark and the milk and so many embellishments, but it adds to the charm. Alfred Hake, who began the business over 100 years ago, his great-grandsons are now in charge of the business and we um, also have the fifth generation working in the business and the sixth generation's been born. So we have a long history of uh, making chocolate here in Adelaide and we will continue to do so for the next 100 or so years, we hope. People want to buy their love's favourite chocolate, so we'll have people um, who are very passionate about peppermint products or berry chocs or um, just even our milk, plain milk chocolate, so they'll, they'll buy that in the heart shape, because it's Valentine's Day and hearts, hearts are always popular, or they'll even come in and they'll just buy an abundance of their, their love's favourite chocolates and surprise them with that. So 60% increase in spending across those three categories, flowers, booze and food. Uh, it's a day where Australians spend about $14 million on, on food and dinner, about half that, $7 million on alcohol. Uh, they obviously go out and buy chocolates by the, no doubt, by the, you know, the tonne. Um, so for retailers, it's a really good day and it's an important day at a pretty quiet time of the year post Christmas. Uh, it's very tempting. So, um, you know, if you're a chocoholic, which everyone pretty much is here, um, everything that you... I've got all of my favourites and I'm always trying to avoid the sections that are doing them. And, um, yeah, it's just very, very delicious and very hard, hard to deal with the temptation.
Well, we actually encourage people not to put it in the fridge because what that does is that changes um, the, the structure of the chocolate. So the best way to, to keep your chocolate cool is to find the coolest place in your house, um, cool dark place, and it will keep it will keep in there for as long as you need. But we find people eat our chocolate so quickly that it doesn't have to last too long. <laughs>